is neither primary school and I was once in this school and I'm very happy to hear that you are willing to help them because I know so many people will benefit from that and I can really say that they have already benefited so many of them and as you can see you need to, some, to do something to them you have to consider everything and God will bless you. Thank you. Childhood and <laughs> childhood and adulthood. Line A and D is equal to line B and C. C. They are equal. The other side we have line B A. Add line C, D. The parallel line. Still on the other side, we find that this line here and this one, they are yes. And also being equal, they are parallel. They are parallel. Now this diagram here, being having parallel lines on both sides, we call it a parallelogram. We call it a parallelogram. One thing I would like to point here is that uh, we appreciate so much of what we are doing because uh, it's logical that wherever something, uh, somebody keeps on coming to you seeking for bread each and every day or something like a fish, it's a nice idea that they say that uh, if you give him a rod, a fishing rod uh, and show him how to fish, tomorrow he will not come back. What I want to say is that uh, what you are doing is that we want to be equipped, we want to be empowered with knowledge and skills so that we may be able to do much things in the field. Uh, right now, if, if, you, if you look at somebody who is educated, who is having knowledge and skills, he's able to do much and uh, exploit uh, much things other than just expect, uh, looking forward for the help which, which is going to be given each and every day. So. It's very, very good of you sir, to, to look into this in terms of education, in terms of uh, in empowering people, empowering the youth, so that we as a youth, we can also reach back to the grassroots, uh, grass, uh, grassroots and also help the, younger, uh, the, younger, the young ones who are still coming up. So we appreciate so much of whatever things you are doing. So whatever thing you are doing, keep it up. Because we know we are going to make it in life. So we appreciate it so much and uh, we thank you a lot. We thank you a lot. 48 years old. I have five children and one baby for my son. I have mom, 70 years old. It's my mom, Jane. I'm Stephen. I'm Maggie. He's my husband and our son Collins. My daughters. I'm Jadida, the second born in our family. She's my grandmama and she's usually happy to see me back from school safe. And I like her so much and she likes me too. Thank you. She's our hope and you are much welcome at our home. She is my mom and she is always so happy to see me at school. Your daughter Adela met my mom at St. Luke Nursing School where my mom was working as a subordinate and Adela had come for her internship. When your daughter arrived here in Kenya, 
my mom welcomed her very well and she assisted her with household chores. This is, she could help her in arranging her house and cooking for her. This was the beginning of their friendship and relationship. Earlier, earlier your daughter wasn't conservat conservant in preparation of Kenyan food, and so my mom offered to assist her in preparation of this food. Olga and mom spent mo most of their time together, and your daughter Olga could reciprocate by teaching her some little English in order to ease their communication. We spent a lot of time together, and by this she could learn that I was interested in furthering my studies, but my mom did not have a stable financial background. So she secretly informed her parents, that is Rocky and Clint, about me and my situation. And when they came to visit, her, to visit their daughter, who was still in Kenya, they surprised me that they were aware of my situation and that they were so willing to take me to school. I was very happy to hear this good news. Uh, I got an admission at Royal College of Science and Technology where I take diploma in biomedical laboratory technology. Later on, Rocky and Clint informed, informed me about the organization that they formed alongside their friends that pick up my sponsorship and I was so glad to hear that news which assured me of realizing my ambition. The challenges then was on my side to put more effort in my studies as a way of appreciation as well as excelling my career studies. <laughs>